Hello everybody, this is Kiss My Shiny Metal A55 back again for another video review of Hook. Hook, Hook, give me a hook. Uh, he is the sixth and final part of Devastator uh, from the Combiner Wars line. And he does also, like I said, have the perfect effect hands. If I could, I would get the originals for him. I just do not like these hands. Just, they just don't work. Uh, but anyways, without further ado, let's get to Hook. Uh, something I don't know if a lot of people realize on this, but on here, this back, it does slide. I did not realize that when I got him. It took me a couple of months to realize it did slide. Uh, I mean, sadly, it does not rotate, but this does raise and lower like that. Yeah. But anyways, well, let's get down to what the repro labels did to him, shall we? Starting with the front, the lights here. Uh, this one here looks crinkled a little bit because of how he goes together with Devastator. Uh, let me pull this back for a minute. I don't know if I can. Uh Right here underneath that light, right here, there's actually a hole there. Uh, for this peg right here, it pegs into it just like that. Uh, it gets in the way. So I just tend to shove it in and let the sticker stay. Uh, and then when it comes out, just flatten the sticker back out. Uh, but yeah, that's the one downside I do have with the Ruffle Label stickers. Because you have to have that inserted here, this peg inserted here, for this part to lock in to Scavenger. Uh, but anyways, he did add the headlights. It added hook right there. Uh, and added that. Now onto the sides here. As you can see on the boom, it added the little caution stickers. Woohoo! Added them on both sides. On the side here, on this part of the cab. We have added sticker here, window here, window. These were already painted on there. It also added a sticker here, and as you can see on the wheels with the hubs. These ones I'm actually kind of proud of because I did it without effing anything up. Actually looks fairly good. Uh, so yeah. Back here on the back, sticker there for the glass. Also that sticker kind of moved over the years but sticker there also woohoo uh sticker there just to get rid of the monotonous black i'm gonna move that back over on the back we more caution yay caution 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 and then we got the tail lights which that really did add with the big monotonous green back here uh, uh yeah uh, yes, rolls, just not on this, as you can see, but anyways, let's get down to putting him in head mode, shall we, to get him into head, not very much to do, just pull this peg down here, sorry, flip this here, which is right here, boom, there's also... Oh, another one right here. When you flip him out, actually, you have to put the hands straight down for this. This one, actually, you'll end up having to do this with. No, it's not that one. It's this one. You'll have to fold. So I have that come around, and there you go. He wraps around, and this right here locks into here. My hook has a problem here with this because that peg broke out uh, and staying in there so voila oh so that's the whole reason why you stopped working hmm. okay and you can see that and then this piece right here also folds down well and then what you do is you flip these up flip these out just like that and there's one right here but you don't have to flip it and just like that and then the head will come out and tab right into these slots here and then there is the head 
Devastator, I have also put the cartoon-esque visor on. Yeah. But as I was saying, it's the cartoon-esque visor there. The way that this goes together, I mean, yeah. It has its flaws and drawbacks. Uh, I mean, now that that peg's busted out, it kind of has a tendency to do that a lot. So, it doesn't like to stay together too well. So, but anywho, that's that. Well, now let's get him back into vehicle mode to go back into robot mode. All right, here he is, back into robot mode. So, to begin off, you lift this up and have that out of the way. Then, you begin to unpeg here, that part unpeg, and this part unpeg, and let them come down. Then, stay in. Then you will bring these and unfold them out like this. And then tab that little part in right there. And this will also, you unfold the foot, that will also tab in. Actually, it won't tab in, it'll just kind of slot in. Do the same with the left foot. Left, right foot, whichever one, I can't ever tell which one's what. And boom. There you have the completed legs. Uh, then, fold that down. Come around here. Drop the arms. Just like so. And then you'll take this and just collapse it down and hook is now complete besides his stupid arms i hate these arms so much but anyways all right now as you can see look he does have a more wiggle waggle with his head Duh. thank god and i do have the visor on there the cartoon-esque visor there are some added stickers down here, also here. Uh, right in here were also some blue stickers added. Uh, and then right there was one, and right there was also another one added to him. Just to give him that G1-esque pop. Uh, but anyways, he does have limited rotation on his arms. I mean... But these ones, uh, they have a backwards joint. Don't understand that point. But, yeah. His hands will rotate. Do what you need to do to pose it. I tend to use this part of the gun for him. But I'm not going to install it today. But, he has ball joints for the hips with the swivels and all that goodness. As you can see, we the feet only they move this way and this way, so you can go woo -woo in that. So you, you he's got a little bit of posability with him. I mean, he's okay figure. I like him. But anyways, let's get them all together. Finally, there's Plushy. Say hi, Plushy. Scavenger, stand, damn it. Okay, I did not buy you so you could fall. And then, bam. So there they all are. He's hiding Mixmaster, sorry. But anyways, there they all are. Here in the next video, I will be reviewing full how to put devastator together uh what i will do instead of transforming them in the video what i will do is is have them already combined in their separate modes to put into the one big giant mode yes so that way it's all different and then that way i can show you all the referral labels that went with him he is with in the combined mode there wasn't a whole lot to do that with but even still, I might as well. No, I'll just wait. But as I said, nice set. 
Set looks really good. Heather, I like them. So, but anyways, this is Kiss My Shiny Metal A55 saying deuces. I don't know if you can see me. Deuces. And I will see you in the next video. Bye!